But we begin with the latest on the controversy surrounding Maine Health, as first reported by the Portland Press Herald, and its move to offer the COVID-19 vaccine to all of its employees, even those who work from home and some people who came here from out of state as contractors. While the health care provider is on defense today, state officials are speaking out about this. The governor in particular is not pulling any punches. New Center Maine's Zach Blanchard reports. Maine's largest health care system facing backlash over its handling of internal vaccination efforts. We are reiterating that our guidelines are requirements. DHHS Commissioner Gene Lambrew saying Tuesday, Maine Health likely violated state guidelines. At failing to follow these guidelines could be a violation of the provider agreements, which set up the terms for them getting the vaccine. Maine Health now admitting it did offer the COVID vaccine to all of its 22,000 employees, including those who aren't on the front lines and even consultants from out of state. But they say they did so before state policy changed mid January to limit availability to those with direct patient contact. A spokesperson saying in a statement in part, Maine Health stands by its decision to secure its full health care system. We believe that it is the best approach for patients, care team members, members and the communities we serve. The fact that guidelines have shifted does not mean we have not been clear about what our position is and how those guidelines should be applied across the state. This all as thousands of Mainers 70 and older still can't even schedule an appointment for a shot. It's absolutely frustrating. Like John and Jane Carlson. I'm sure they're doing the best they can and it's just I wish <laughs> I wish they'd call us. The CDC says it is working to better streamline the registration process statewide, but with still not enough doses coming into Maine, any lapse leaves the most vulnerable at even greater risk. We will continue to be and be more aggressive with our providers to ensure that they are following the governor's guidelines. Now, Maine Health did not return our request for an on-camera interview with system leadership. In Portland, I'm Zach Blanchard, News Center, Maine. And just a short time ago, we heard from Governor Mills about this. She issued a statement saying Maine Health's decision to vaccinate outside of this strategy undermines the public's confidence in our efforts. Simply put, Mills says it was not the appropriate way to give away our precious vaccine. She went on to criticize Maine Health for vaccinating those out-of-state contractors who she says came to disrupt union organizing efforts in Maine Medical Center, and she called that an insult to hardworking nurses.